I'm here with Angie today to talk a little bit about the Superhero Try. Um, Angie, you were very keen to be part of the Superhero Try this year. Why is this event so important to you? It's a new event for Surrey Coalition of Disabled People and it's an opportunity to raise funds for the organisation. Great. You've been, uh, you've experienced the event before. How did you get involved with the event last time? Last time I did Winter Wonder Wheels, which is the winter version of Superhero Try, and I did it through White Lodge Centre. Oh, great. And can you describe the day to us? Yeah, basically it was a very busy day, very cold at the time. It was in December and um, it was exciting as well. Um, there were lots of us um, doing various parts of the event which involves swimming in the lake, um, cycling round the Eaton Dorney track and the lake and also um, people were running around it as well so it's very busy but enjoyable and good fun. Great what was your what's your highlight of the day? Um, for me it was actually um, making the um, goal of achieving 10k which is two laps of the lake and also having the opportunity of meeting Johnny Peacock one of the Paralympians. Oh fantastic so you had celebrity involvement as well. That's right yeah. yeah great um, and what did you find the biggest challenge that you had to overcome? Uh, my biggest challenge was um, the hand cycling itself, it was only my second opportunity to take part in hand cycling. My first opportunity was at the Calvert Trust in Exmoor, where I did a 2K hand cycle round Wisp Poundland a Reservoir um, in Devon. And then I wanted to um, set myself a new challenge by um, doing 10K. Quite a big step up. Certainly in was for you there, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and how about this time round? Um, what sort of training will you be undertaking to get ready for the event? Well, it's mainly mainly strength training and um, trying to improve my fitness levels a bit as well. Um, but it's it's mainly just being able to stay the course, really. Definitely. And what strengths do you think you've got personally that are going to enable you to achieve that? Um, I've got lots of determination and I just love um, setting myself new goals and challenges all the time. And I, I think I'm hoping I can be an inspiration to others. Fantastic. Well, you're certainly an inspiration to me, Angie. I think it's amazing what you what you do. As you say, you're always challenging yourself. Um, and I'm really, really looking forward to the day. What are you most looking forward to about it? Um, I'm looking forward to just having fun, basically. I think this is what this day is all about. It's about having fun and hopefully being with other colleagues from my organisation and having fun together. Great. Looking forward to it.